boys and girls, Miss Kristen has a counting book for you today. My story is called On the Launch Pad, a counting book about rockets. The author was Michael Dahl, and two people worked on the illustrations, the pictures in the story. Derek Alderman did the illustrations, and Denise Shea helped too. There were three people that worked on this counting book. Okay. All right. Miss Kristen needs your help counting. Twelve stars twinkle in the morning sky. Here's the number twelve. There's the word twelve, and then a one, and a two, and then there are twelve dots. You are going to help Miss Kristen count the stars. We'll start over here. Are you ready? All right, count with me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12. Good job. All right. In this story, we're going to count backwards. So we do 12. The next is 11. We have to take one away. We subtract one. It says 11 workers take care of tasks. Tasks are things to do. It's a tricky word to say. Tasks. It means something to do. All right, our job is to help with the workers. Now this picture takes up both pages. We'll look over here first. Okay, we have to make sure there's 11 workers. Are you ready? One, two, three, four, five, here's six, Seven, eight, nine, ten, and eleven. Did you see the workers' uniform? The clothes that they wear to do their job? They're wearing orange. Okay, over here, the word eleven. This is how you make eleven with the numbers. A one and a one. And here's eleven dots. Okay, we did 12, 11, then we take another one away, and we get 10. Oh, look, here's the word 10. This is how you make 10 with numbers, a 1 and a 0, and there's 10 dots. Okay, let's see what the words say over here. 10 engineers, people that build things, 10 engineers. Watch their screens. Okay, so we need to count 10 engineers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There are 10 engineers helping with the launch. Okay, we did 12, 11, 10. Now we need nine. Ooh. Nine spotlights shine up on the rocket. Here's the bottom of the rocket. This is kind of like a red fence or a red pole to help the rocket stand up. You don't want the rocket to fall over. We need it to stand up so it can go in space. Okay, we need to count nine spotlights. Okay, here's our number nine. There's the word nine. Okay, we'll start over here. Here's the first spotlight. It's kind of like a really big flashlight. It's very bright. Okay. One, 
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Good job. Number nine. Okay. Now we need to take one away. We did 12, 11, 10, nine, eight. Good job. Eight trucks carry the fuel. The rocket needs fuel or gas to fly up to space. So we need to count not, sorry, we need to count eight trucks. Here's eight. It reminds me of a snowman. Okay, so we need to count eight trucks. We'll start over here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight trucks. Okay, we did 12, 11, 10, nine, eight. We need to take one away. Mm, seven. <gasps> seven radar dishes. You might have a radar, it kind of looks like a TV, satellite, or at your house. These are seven radar dishes, silently standing. They'll help us with the rocket. Okay. The radar dishes only need one page. Okay, we'll start over here. So we need seven. One, two, three. That one looks a little different. Four, five, six, seven. Good job, there's seven satellites. Now we need to take one away, we're counting backwards. We did 12, 11, 10, nine, eight, seven, this number's next. Do you remember? There's the word six and the number six. It has a belly. Six astronauts ride the elevator. Do you remember the astronaut is the person that goes to space? They have to wear a special space suit and boots and gloves and a very special helmet to go up in space. So we need to count six astronauts. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. Good job. Okay, we did 12, 11, 10, nine, eight, seven, six. Now we need to take one away from six. <gasps> Five, good counting backwards. Okay. Five, control, panels, glow, and hum. These are the control panels. They have switches and dials to help get the rocket ship all the way to space. So we need to count the whole rectangle, okay? So here's one, two, three, four, five. Five control panels to help the rocket. Good job. All right, we had five. We need to take one away. <gasps> Let's see, one, two, three, four. Let's see. Four windows gleam in the dawn. The windows are gleaming. They're shining or sparkling. And the dawn, do you remember what dawn is? Very early in the morning when the sun is coming up. It's called dawn. Okay, we need to count four windows. Okay. They kind of look like the shape of a diamond. 
All right, let's count. One, two, three, four. Good job, like the number four or the word four. Okay, we had five, four, three is next. Good job. Three launch towers slide away. Okay, do you remember Miss Kristen said the launch towers, they're kind of like a fence or a ladder. They help the rocket stand up. You want the rocket to stand up so it can go to space. You don't want it to fall over. Okay, let's count the towers. One, two, three. Good job. All right, we had five, four, three. We need to take one away. Boop! That leaves one, two. Good job. Two rocket engines rumble and roar. Can you roar? Roar. Good job. Okay, the engines are at the bottom of the rocket. Let's see, we need to count them. One, two. Oh, just like the number two. There's the word, T-W-O. Here's the number two. And I think I see two dots. Yep, one, two, good job. Okay, let's see, we had five, four, three, two, we need to take one away. Boop. That leaves just one. Okay. This page is different. Boop. I have to turn it to read the words. It says one, there's the word one, O-N-E. One shining rocket aims towards the stars. Blast off. All right, help me count the rockets. I only see one into space. Okay, Miss Kristen has a question for you. Would you want to go all the way to space in a rocket ship? Hmm, Miss Kristen has something to show you. Here's our planet Earth. You would have to leave the earth. You'd have to leave Syracuse. And remember we talked about we live in New York. We live in the United States of America. Here's New York over here. We live in the United States of America. We live on North America. We live on the earth. You would have to leave the earth to go all the way up into space. Let's see. Miss Kristen, would you want to go up to space? Hmm. I like flying on airplanes. I would like to go all the way up in space. Okay, think in your brain. Would you want to ride or fly on the rocket?